Well, my father was a club pro. He built, uh, he was also a coach at a Bluffton University in Ohio. He uh, bought a farm, built a driving range, nine holes, used his football team to build it. And uh, then when I was 13, he built a, bought the farm next door and built another nine. And I got to be in on that. So I've been around golf all my life. kind of like a doctor, you know, when he goes to school and studies and, and figures out how to operate. You don't want him going, whoops, or, oh, I can't do this, you take over, you know, so you train yourself to uh, execute the shot. You think out the shot, you visualize, and you do. two out of the first three and bogey two of the last three <laughs> for about five tournaments. Then I, finally I said, uh, I'm gonna pretend I already played nine holes and I'm mad and I'm gonna be more aggressive on the first hole, pretend it's my 10th hole. So I would play games like that and I still do today play different games uh, in my head. You know, you're putting for a bogey from 20 feet, it's depressing. Well, you know, if I hit two good shots, I'd be all excited about making it for birdie. So I, I do stuff like that to keep my my focus and interest. I'm still fired up. I still have goals to reach that I haven't. So I am excited about playing. I hope I can keep my health for three or four more years and uh, do something that uh, I know I've been capable of doing that, that I haven't done yet.